good morning in this video we are going to discuss about the muscle spindle muscle spindle present in the skeletal muscle this is the receptor for the stretch reflex it is variable in number depend on the activity of the skeletal muscle each muscle spindle contains 3 to 10 intrafusal muscle fibers so in this diagram these are the intrafusal muscle fibers it is present in between the extrafusal muscle fiber this is the extrafusal muscle fiber extra fusal muscle fiber is nothing but the skeletal muscle so intra fusal muscle fiber covered by the connective tissue thin connective tissue with the fluid compartment cavity so the type of intra fusal muscle fibers this intrafusal muscle fibers attach with the endomysium of the skeletal muscles endomysium of the skeletal muscles type of intramuscle fibers are nuclear back fibers this is the nuclear back fibers this is the one of the one type of the intrafusal muscle fibers each muscle spindle contains 2 to 5 nuclear back fibers the 30 micrometer diameter 7 mm length in the intra nuclear back fibers central portion has the dilated portion it contains many nuclei so it is divide divide of contractile protein contractile protein is mainly present in the polar end side polar end it contains the actin and myosin so this is a contractile portion of the nuclear back fibers this is the non contractile portion this is the sensory portion of the nuclear back fibers nuclear chain fibers this is the nuclear chain fibers nucleus arranged in the chain format so this is called as the nuclear chain fibers the each muscle spindle contains 6 to 10 nuclear chain fibers the diameter is 15 micrometer diameter length is 4 mm length nerve supply of the muscle spindle the muscle spindle having the both sensory and motor nerve supply so the muscle spindle is the only receptor having the motor supply this is the important point the receptors only ha receptors having the motor supply is the muscle spindle the primary only a fibers is the sensory nerve supply to the muscle spindle it supplies to the central portion of the nuclear back fibers and central portion of the nuclear chain fibers it forms the anulo spiral ending it forms the spire anulo spiral ending its diameter is 17 micron the conduction of conduction velocity of this nerve fiber is 70 to 120 meters per second so during the stretch of the muscle spindle this primary one a afferent is stimulated since the sense impulse the response is different for the different type of response during the activation of the nuclear back fibers it produces the dynamic response stimulate the primary one a afferent fibers in the stimulation of the chain fibers it produces the static response send the impulse to the primary one a afferent fibers
type 2 secondary afferent fibers supplies to the follower end of the nuclear chain fibers in the form of flower spray ending it is respond to the muscle sustained stretch and it measure the muscle length muscle spindle is the only organ receptor organ supplies the motor nerve mainly comma motor neuron supplies the muscle uh, muscle spindle because the a comma axon fibers supplying to the muscle spindles it is two types comma dynamic supplies to the polar end of the nuclear fibers it is more sensitivity to muscle spindle through the primary 1a afferent fibers so comma motor neuron increases the sensitivity of the primary 1a fibers this is the responsible for the gendrastic maneuver you will read in the reflexes and uh, it is the plate ending comma dynamic ends in the polar region of the nuclear fibers in the form of plate ending and uh, comma static fibers supplies to the nuclear chain, chain fibers in the trade rail ending so it uh, increases the tonic discharge tonic response muscle tone is sent through the primary one a fibers at the any muscle lens so it is send the impulse through the primary one a fiber through the muscle tone the status of the muscle tone through the one a fiber at the any muscle lens functions of muscle spindle muscle spindle is the receptor organ for the stretch reflex so it is also important for the maintaining the muscle tone through the increases the comma motor neuron activity the muscle spindle also important for the maintenance of the posture especially standing posture through the production of the stretch reflexes and it is also act as the proprioceptors it is for the unconscious proprioceptive sensation and conscious kinesthetic sensations so during the conscious movement unconscious movement the proprioception is posture movement is regulated by the stretch reflex summary of the structure and function of the muscle spindle muscle spindle is the receptor organ for the stretch reflex it is present in the skeletal muscle the muscle spindle made up of intrafusal fibers it has the two types of fibers nuclear back fibers and nuclear chain fibers it has the two types of innervation sensory and motor innervation sensory innervation is primary one a afferent through the anulospiral ending in the central area of the nuclear back fibers and nuclear chain fibers secondary 2a afferent fibers are only supplies to the uh, polar region of the nuclear chain fibers in the flower spray entry and motor supplies to the dynamic comma motor neuron to the polar region of the nuclear back fibers by the plate ending and uh, uh, da static dynamic static fibers to the uh, polar region of the nuclear chain, chain fibers by the trial ending the functions of the muscle spindles are it is important for the receptor organ of the a stretch reflex so it is the important for the skeletal muscle activity it is maintaining the muscle tone by the increases the comma motor neuron discharge it is also act as the proprioceptors the muscle spindle also a type of the proprioceptors thank you for watching this video if you like this video share your friends those who are not subscribed this channels please subscribe thank you once again